This is Joe Drums coming to you. I hope everybody out there is doing great. I'm doing awesome as usual. Uh, I've got a little story to tell you. Um, about a month ago, I was uh, working on my computer here uh, late at night. It was about a little after 1 o'clock. And I had uh, some work to do. And it was a little chilly down here. And I had a space heater. And I put the space heater on next to me, which is about maybe three feet away. And uh, as I was working, I started to fall asleep and went to sleep for about five, maybe four or five hours. I don't know exactly. But when I woke up, I ended up getting a second degree burn on my arm. And uh, right now, like I said, it's been about a month and maybe a week. And I've been putting ointment on it. I went to the doctors and she said to put uh, some antibiotic cream on it and to keep it, you know, moist and everything. So I've been doing that. But it just doesn't seem like it's going away. It seems like it's taking a long time. Um, so I'm going to the doctors again Friday and we're going to take a look at this thing and see what's going on with it. But don't fall asleep when you have a space heater on. It's definitely not the, the way to go. Uh, I'll never do that again. It was just a stupid move on my part. But, you know, it is what it is and now I've got to deal with it. So... Just watch it, you know, be careful of the space heaters, turn them off or, you know, have a, have one with an automatic, you know, on and off switch on it. Um, so hopefully that, you know, you guys don't end up like this one day. So anyway, um, the way, the reason for this video now today is I wanted to talk about a song that I've been listening to since I was real little. Uh, I remember when I first heard it on the radio, it was one of those songs that as soon as you heard it, the beat just captured your, you know, your uh, interest. So as I was listening to the song for the first time, it just kept, the beat was nice and straight, real punchy, just had a good rhythm to it, makes you want to dance, that kind of a thing. And the song I'm talking about is All Right Now by the band The Free. And uh, so Paul Rogers was the lead singer of the band. Uh, I'm not really sure what the drummer's name was. I never followed the band because, again, they were they were an older band. Um, they really only had that one big hit, unless there was another hit that I'm un unaware of. But that was the only hit that I remember that they had. Uh, but it was a good hit, and it lasted years and years. And every time I hear it, it still reminds me of the first time I heard it. Um, what's really cool about it is it, it stays straight through the whole beat. It changes a little bit of variation throughout it, very minimal. Um, some, some great fills on it, some real powerful fills. Um, you really don't want to overplay this. And so today I actually, I'm, I'm reading the chart of it, um, and I followed it to a T as best as I could, or as followed it as, as the way the person whoever wrote this um, they look like they did a pretty good job on keeping it pretty accurate. So I just followed it as best as I could with the music and everything. So I'm going to show you that video right now of me playing it, performing it. Obviously without the music for copyright infringement because I'll just shut the video down. So I'm tired of doing that. So again, you're only going to see it with just the drum part playing. And uh, you can kind of see what was going on when the drummer played this. For this song in the recording studio. Boy, I would have loved to have seen this for the first time in the recording studio. Him playing the song and watching the drummer play it and just created an absolute monster beat. So, again, if you've never heard the song before, I urge you to listen to it. Again, it's All Right Now by The Free, the band called The Free. Later on, I think they just called themselves Free, but uh, in the early days, they used to call it The Free. So. Uh, with Paul Rogers and now Paul Rogers has gone on obviously with Bad Company and now he's singing with Queen so uh, yeah he's been around a long long time great rock vocal in fact I've always looked up to him as not you know just for the great music that he's given us but also for the great vocals that sound just phenomenal I'd always 
wanted my voice to sound like his. But man, it was like the coolest voice, you know, that uh, rock could ever give you, you know. So anyway, again, if you uh, like this video, please like and subscribe. If you haven't subscribed to me, please do so. I'd love to have you as a subscriber. Um, click on that bell so that uh, it'll give you a, uh, a announcement that if I have a new video coming up. And I'm going to try to start putting more videos together. I've got some great information and some great uh, gadgets and things that I'm going to be talking about in the next couple videos. So stick around for that. And uh, let's take a look at the uh, All Right Now, me playing the drum part to it. And we'll talk to you guys next video. Until then, take care. Keep rocking. This is Joe Drums signing off.